yourself. We have been invited to the grand opening of the Atlantis, the Royal Hotel in Dubai and Beyonce is performing there. And our dresses arrived that we're going to be wearing on the red carpet when we meet Beyonce. Maybe. Yeah, we just say that because you know, manifest. <laughs> And we're about to open them in front of you guys. Remember, we don't have a backup, so this this is the this dress. is what we're wearing on the red carpet. So if it doesn't fit us, it's gonna be falling down. We leave for Dubai in like three days, so nothing like the last minute. Yep, I'm just so glad they actually came. Oh my too. But are they gonna fit us? That's the next issue. <laughs> Literally, are we gonna have to get them tailored? We don't know. And no, we we're them hopeful. On. We've stayed really positive. We only received the dress. <laughs> Let's open them. Come ah, ah, I'm scared. What if we don't even like them? This is our only option. We don't have any backups, guys. Charlie <laughs> wants to see the dresses. Actually, Charlie's really good at opening boxes, so he's gonna do it for me. Thanks, Charlie. Oh, you're so good at it. As you guys can tell, these boxes are pretty big, so it's not just like a little satin dress. It's, it's like. It's a big it's gown. A big boy. A, we went all out. Yeah, it's the red carpet, and this is the biggest event we've ever been invited to. So we went big. We certainly have. And you, you just don't know what other people are gonna wear. <laughs> nah. We're gonna but rock either way, on. we are gonna rock these dresses with confidence. And yeah, it's time. This is the moment of truth. <laughs> Careful. I wonder which dress this is. <gasps> wow, they really pack it up good. Mm, it is big, isn't it? <laughs> Feels heavy. This has to go in a suitcase. Holy, holy. Whoa. Get rid of that box. Hold that, dear. Oh my gosh. Which one have you given me? What fate have you just given me? Nah, nah. Guys, we actually haven't decided who's wearing what style, so we're going to try both of them on and then decide from there. Oh. But we both kind of like one, one style slightly better more. than the other. How do we do this? Don't cut the dress. Oh, it comes in a little bag. <gasps> Which one do you have? Oh my gosh. Oh, no. <gasps> it looks different. Oh, it's so heavy. It looks super different. Huh? Wait, we haven't even reacted to them. Are we scared? We're scared. We're scared. Because, like, we have nothing else to wear. I am scared. But how stunning are they? But the colour is beautiful. We've never really, like, rocked red before for, like, anything. But you guys aren't going to see them on now. You are going to see them when we have our hair and makeup done and we're in Dubai. Stay tuned for when we actually put these dresses on for real. But here's a little close-up. These are so heavy. Oh, my God. I'm scared to try it on. Top of the morning to you. It is the next day. And we are stressed. Those dresses you saw us unbox may not be the dresses we're wearing on the red carpet. Oh my gosh, guys, they were huge. Like, they were falling down on both of us. My zip didn't zip up for some reason, so I couldn't actually see how it fit me because it didn't fit me. And mine is so much more princessy than in the pictures. Yeah, it didn't look like so that puffy the in the pictures. Yeah, it was overwhelming last night. We literally had a little meltdown of like, what are we gonna do? I was like, do we go buy dresses in Dubai when we get there? Or because you know dresses you have to really try on, but we bought ours online. We hoped for the best and Yeah. So right now we're on our way to a gown place. But we're going to this place as like a backup option. Because it's nice to have a backup, which we did not have and we still don't have. on the dresses that we were interested in and I guess our favorite was the navy which was weird because we weren't even gonna try it on because I was like I don't like navy dresses like personally on me I'm just like I'd rather wear like a brighter color I don't know, I've just never liked navy <laughs> but then when we tried them on I was like oh I actually like this so that's why they always say just try it on because you never know yeah we love the style of those we also really liked the navy blue because they were different styles so same color but different style and that's kind of the vibe that we 
we're going for. If our red dresses, once we've had them altered, if we still don't like them, that's 100% an option because she's got the sizes in store. So, navy or red? Not sure. We're not we, sure until we, we will see. get the alterations done. So after our auntie spent hours and hours altering both dresses, we decided to go with the red. Um, my bag didn't get on the flight apparently, so I don't have anything. What? Sam's bag never got on the flight from Perth to Dubai. My bag arrived, Sam's did not. Yeah. So the dress that I need for the main event, the red carpet, it's not here right now. We literally jinxed it. We put it out to the universe. <laughs> and we were joking around because our auntie spent hours and hours. She literally spent 24 hours yeah. full on, not doing anything else. She literally didn't stop. Yep, she was altering both of our dresses. Such a huge job. And so that's where we were that's like, why we you joke. imagine we like, if now like, imagine. yeah, something happened to the dress or, or it didn't make it. That's reality now. It didn't make it to Dubai. So we obviously contacted the airline and they said it should be on the next flight to Dubai. There's only one flight a day that leaves from Perth to Dubai. So my bag should be delivered to this hotel at the same time that we arrived today. Yeah. But hopefully, you know, I'm scared. Well, I didn't get on the first time, so. <laughs> it's just a big inconvenience, but I'll be fine. We literally have called 50 different people today to try and make sure my bag gets on tonight's flight because there's only one flight from Perth to Dubai and if it's not on that flight, I won't be wearing the dress for tomorrow's event. So it has to be on that flight. And obviously I want all my clothes. I want my pajamas, I want my underwear, I want my makeup. I've literally been sharing everything of Tegan's. It's been weird. When you do your makeup with someone else's like products and brushes, it, it really puts you out of whack. Like. It was weird. Guys, I just found out that my bag is on the plane and it's on its way to Dubai. Best news ever, honestly. I was really positive in the beginning and then- it's no. on the plane! Literally no one had answer and I was like, I'm not gonna get my dress, I'm not gonna get all my stuff, but somehow it's happened after calling 50 million people. We did it! Thank goodness. Stress, stress, stress. Now I can relax. We have the red carpet tonight, Beyonce's, Beyonce's coming. performing, there's fireworks, there's an after party, there's dinner, everything, everything is happening today. The red carpet is what we bought those amazing dresses for. Mine still hasn't arrived, which is freaking me out. It's on its way, it's but on like, its, way, it's not apparently. in our hands just yet, so. So I'm still nervous, mm. because you know, apparently they're dropping off other bags first. But first we have a makeup artist coming. Guys, I can't believe that my bag finally came. I'm so, so lucky. Well, actually not lucky, we, um, <laughs> nah. Mum spent hours and hours on the phone. She talked to so many people, because you know, mum's are good at that. So thanks, mum.